Hey guys, today I'm going to be talking all about different ways to defog your goggles. Most goggles, including the Speedo Vanquisher goggles, come with a special coating that keeps them from fogging up, but we all know that that doesn't last forever, and eventually after using them for a few days, maybe a few weeks if you're really careful, it does eventually wear off. So I do have some different tricks that I've tried, and then also my favorite one that works the absolute best. So we're gonna get started. The first and easiest way that I have tried is just spitting in your goggles and rubbing around with a finger, which can be really gross, especially if you just ate food. It could get in your eye and irritate it. If you're sick, you could get pink eye. Or, like, picture sharing goggles with friends, knowing that they've spit in their goggles and then you have to use them. Ew. It's just not very sanitary and it's also not very reliable, but it is the simplest way that I have tried. The second way that a lot of people have been using now is using the spit product. This is just a special product that helps keep your goggles from fogging up. It is $9 for a one ounce bottle, so it is pretty expensive for what it is. And it doesn't really work that well. It does wear off after each time that you use it. And if you're gonna pay $9 for an ounce of whatever mixture this is, you'd think it would just last for like a few days, but you do have to reapply it every time you get in the pool. The final option that works the absolute best is baby shampoo. Before I talk about this more, I just want to say you have to get baby shampoo, not regular shampoo, because if that gets in your eyes, it'll sting like hell. But this doesn't sting because, of course, it's meant for babies, so this is the safer way to go. But all you have to do is take about a pea-sized amount on one finger, rub it between two fingers so you get about half of the amount, and then you rub it into each goggle, get it around all the sides, on the lenses, and then you rinse it out in the pool right before you get in. You don't want to rinse it in the sink because the water from the faucet can be kind of hard and can actually wash it all out. So you want to dunk it in the pool, swirl it around just a little bit on each goggle. And I usually do this two or three times of swirling each goggle, but you don't want to do it too much because you don't want to rinse it out. It does work super well. Even though you have to reapply this for every time you get in the pool, just like the Spit product, this is $2 for a one and a half ounce bottle whereas the spit product is $9 for a one ounce bottle. I would say the baby shampoo is a little bit better and it's way, way, way cheaper. And I was really hesitant to try it at first because I have really, really sensitive eyes. If I even get a drop of chlorinated water in my eye, it gets so bright red during practice. And I look like I have pink eye, even though I don't. But I tried it and I was like, okay, wow, this works really well. So even if you have sensitive eyes and you're nervous about it, Trust me, it still works and it shouldn't irritate your eyes. These three different tricks are not original, I didn't come up with them. So maybe you guys already knew about the baby shampoo trick and let me know in the comments below if you do. And also, let me know if there's another trick that I don't know about. I would love to try it out. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you found it helpful. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!